Find the slope of a line perpendicular to the line 3x plus 2y is equal to 6. So if I have one line, so let me draw some quick axes here. So that's my y-axis, and that is my x-axis. And let's say I have a line here that has a slope of m. So the slope over here is equal to m. A line, who's, a line that is perpendicular to this line would intersect it at 90 degrees. So it would look something like this. It would look something like this. This would be a 90 degree angle. And the slope here, and I won't prove it in this video. We talk about it in other videos. The slope here is going to be equal to the negative reciprocal of this line's slope. So it's going to be the negative reciprocal of that slope. So, or another way, it's going to be it's going to be negative one over this slope, or the negative reciprocal. Now, with that out of the way, if we could figure out the slope of this line right over here, we would just have to take the negative reciprocal, and we would have the slope of the perpendicular line. So, let's figure out the slope of this line. So, let me rewrite it: three x plus two y is equal to six. And the easiest thing to do is to solve for y. So we get it into y equals mx plus b form, and then the slope will be pretty obvious. So let's get rid of the x on the left-hand side. So let's subtract x, 3x from both sides, I should say. And then the left-hand side, we're left with just a 2y. The right-hand side, we have a negative 3x plus six. Now we can divide both sides by two. So we have to divide all the terms on the right-hand side by two we get y is equal to negative 3 halves x, that's that part right over there, plus 3. So the slope of this line right over here that they give us, the slope of this line, now that we've put it in mx plus b form, slope intercept form, we know that the slope of this line is negative 3 halves. That is the slope. So the slope of a line that is perpendicular to this will be the negative reciprocal of this. So the negative of a negative is a positive. So it's going to be a positive, And then the reciprocal of 3 halves is going to be 2 over 3. So the negative reciprocal of, three, of negative 3 halves is positive 2 over 3. So that's we're done. That's the slope of a line that is perpendicular to this one right over here.